So, is it possible to get good results with the <coughs> six inch squeegee? Yeah. Oh. Let's have a go. Obviously, the downside to doing it with a small squeegee is you've got to do more turns on the glass. But can you get a good result? Not too bad. There's a couple of little little bits up there, little bits down here. Give it another go. Just to see. Overall, it's uh, it's doable. It's doable. And this comes in handy for doing little windows, really. I'm not a professional, remember. I just kind of enjoy doing it. <laughs> Weird. little bit more safe it's, you can feel it skidding a bit not a bad result let's just try a little bit more safe I'll just stick with the, the green stuff it ain't magic formula it's just washing up liquid that's all it is Probably a bit too thick now. Mm. Better. Right, one more going and uh, we'll have a look. Inside to do man. It's definitely gliding a lot better. A bit more safe on the uh, window. Uh, cocked up there. Let me just do one more. Oh, not too bad. So, have a look at the results. Of that. that side's not too bad. A little bit here, quite a bit, quite a bit there actually. Obviously, you just get that with your cloth anyway, and that just disappears. That goes. There's a bit on the top as well. Uh, that side's pretty, pretty clean. A little bit there, and obviously the bottom is just really the rubber. I'll even say it's still a pretty good result from a six inch squeegee which I basically just chopped up myself so yeah it's all about your rubbers use, use a 
a decent rubber and you can get amazing results amazing results everybody likes a six inch squeegee